Hi folks, it's Nexon Galaxy S4 root.com where we get hooked on Android every day. Anyway, today I'm going to show you how to root the Galaxy S4 in less than three minutes. So let's go do this, baby. Uh. All right, let's go ahead and root our Galaxy S4 active. Uh, before we begin, make sure to go to settings, about device, and uh, under under build number, it should end in uh, AM, AMF3. Let me go ahead and... Uh, do a close up here so you can actually see. I should end in AMF3 like that. Uh, if it, it doesn't, um, you might be on a newer firmware. I don't even feel work on the newer firmware, uh, but you can try it. Uh, but if you're on this build number, it will work. Um, next, go ahead and go to the site called geohot.com slash active root. I also have links um, so you can copy and paste. Go ahead and go to it straight from your phone. Uh, this is the maker of the actual root uh, process. So. Um, you know, if you want to donate um, because you're thankful, don't forget to hit the donate button. Uh, but let's go ahead and root it. Go ahead and hit the button. This will download the uh, APK file. Go ahead and click on it. And uh, I should say uh, install locked. Simply go to settings here and then go ahead and click the unknown sources on. Hit OK. And go ahead and, and hit the home button. Uh, and go back to uh, downloads here in your app drawer. And go ahead and click on the ar.apk and go ahead and hit install installing um, say i understand this app may be dangerous go ahead and install and go ahead and open and this will have rooted uh, your galaxy s4 active now this will install the su binaries you still need to install super su um, so go ahead and type super su and install the free version of super su and go ahead and accept and once that's done downloading, go ahead and open. All right, and then go ahead and uh, hit continue when it asks you as you binary needs to be updated and hit normal and boom shakalaka. You have full root on your Samsung Galaxy S4 active. Now you can verify this is uh, working by going ahead downloading a rooted app such as Titanium Backup app. Go ahead and install, accept. And can we get another boom shock locker? There we go. And let me go ahead and open it. You should have a boom shock locker, a super user request window. Go ahead and hit grant. Uh, and that's how you root um, your Samsung Galaxy S4 active. And uh, that's it. Now, one more thing about rooting. Uh, this will give you some uh, information because um, the AT&T firmware will detect your root. And it'll say um, it has detected an application doing unpermitted actions, uh, reboot your phone. Now, you can just ignore it. But if, it's th if it gets annoying to you, um, you can go ahead and remove a file. Um, that will get rid of it completely. So go ahead and download ES File Explorer. And go ahead and hit Install, Accept. And give it a second here. And go to um, open. And go ahead and slide zoom here. And go ahead and hit the menu button real quick. Go to tools. Uh, go to root explorer. And hit grant. All right. And go ahead and hit the menu button again. Um, go to root explorer again. And you you'll have a menu for mount read write. Uh, go ahead and read write for slash system and slash. All right. And we're going to go ahead and go to slash system app. And you can change the view so it's more alphabetical. Uh, let's choose medium detail. Go all the way down to K. And there should be a file we can uh, erase. There we go. A Canox agent, right? You can either rename it. All right, um, or delete it. I'm gonna go ahead and just delete these two. Canoxagent.apk and .odex. Uh, or actually, you know what? Let's just rename it. Just in case you need it later. Um, I'm gonna rename it to Agent2. Oh, actually, you know what? Sorry. You'll have to rename the last three. So I'm just gonna rename it uh, APK2. And this will not allow it to run. And also rename the Odex version also. Just add two at the end, and that should do. All right, and that will fix uh, the uh, warning. So now you will not have that warning message. 
it will not affect your phone in any way. And thanks guys for watching this video. If this video has helped you root your Samsung Galaxy S4 active in less than five minutes, don't forget to hit that like button here, subscribe button down there, and I will see you guys soon. Uh, stay on Android.